What's up guys? Blunts and ID. Today I'm going to quickly show you how to um, get um, Clockwork Mod into your LG Optimus Elite. Now, um, first of all, I'd like to say a um, big round of applause to AndroidForums.com because without this, this just wouldn't um, be happening right now. You know, um, it's a giant step for the LG Optimus Elite. And what Clock um, Word Mod Recovery does is basically it lets you flash custom kernels, it lets you flash ROMs, it lets you make an Android backups in case your phone bricks. It's just very useful. So let's get into this. First of all, you can go to settings, go to about phone, and click system updates, and click LG update software. This will work for Virgin Mobile and Sprint as well. Then you're going to go into applications, have a known sources checked, and have USB debug debugging on. And, um, okay, wait. <coughs> and then you're going to want to plug in your USB. And this can be done from the phone itself, but I'll show you on a computer just to be um, make it shorter. And so check on mass storage. And also, you're going to want to have go into your Play Store and get Terminal Emulator app. Should have a link in the description. It's free on the Play Store. And second, you're going to want the bin file I included in the description, and it should be in a link too. That bin file is the custom Clockwork mod, so um, you're going to need that. So once you download it, it should be this thingy. And hold up, let me go into my finder. For Windows, it'd be my computer. Um, let me see here. Okay, right here. I have my phone, this is my SD card, and this is my internal SD card. And you can drag this just into the root of your SD card, so make sure it's just in there. Just drag it in there. See, I already have it, so I'll just replace it. And once you do that, eject them. Eject both the devices. Alright, eject this one. And you're gonna go to your phone. Make sure it's on charge only, or you could just unplug it. Just make sure it's not connected. And that that finishes too. Make sure that's done. All right. And um, unfortunately, I won't be able to do the codes with you. But um, here's the part where you guys have to do this individually and by yourselves. So. I expect you to be independent. So go into your terminal and in the link in the description, I mean in the description, I will have codes. Now you are to type the codes one by one. And if you do it correctly, you should um you should reboot your phone and you should have it install um installed. But let me just shut down my phone to show you how you're gonna um turn custom um, check if you have it installed <clears throat> when you when you hit the commands and the goes inside the terminal app um, um, if you know you got it correct you know you got it correctly if it just says like nothing after it just repeats the number sign oh, well it's hard to explain but you just know when you get it right trust me all right, you're gonna hold. You're gonna do that by holding down the power button and holding down the volume down button at the same time, and you power it up like that. That's what I did. And just hold it until a custom clockwork mod comes out, and there you go. You have custom clockwork mod. Um, you have it. You could basically go and start flashing ROMs and such. So that's basically how you do it. If you have any questions, comments, you know, put them in the description link. Remember when you are typing the codes to use spaces 
Um, I will put down where to use spaces, but that's basically how you do it. So, um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And the reason I say to like is so other people can watch this and um, the video gets more views. That way, other people can do this. And yeah, we have a community going on there. So, Blunt90, peace out.